physio for ITU and theatres in Morrison Hospital. Um, so preparing the patient. Uh, have all the lines been cited for the patient including an FMS? Yes. Is the patient sedated and paralysed? Yes. Is the patient on 100% oxygen? Yes. Are blue ET tapes in situ? Yes. Has the NG been aspirated? Yes. Are all non-essential infusions stopped and disconnected? Yes. Have any drugs been bolus that are required? Yes. Are the patient's hips and shoulders protected with ground flex or padding? Yes. Have all non-essential monitoring been uh, removed, including ECG dots? Yes. Is the catheter an FMS at the end of the bed? Yes. Is the patient's hands uh, positioned correctly? Yes, they are underneath his bottom. Preparing the equipment. Essential monitoring in situ, ETCO2 and saturations? Yes. What is the plan if the ET tube becomes dislodged during the manoeuvre? We're going to uh, put back supine and re-intubate with our airway trolley ready. Have all emergency drugs been prepared? Yes. Have we got a minimum of three pillows, two slide sheets, two clean sheets, and three ECG dots? Yes. Preparing the team. Have you got sufficient staff to complete this manoeuvre safely? Yes. Are the tallest members of the team at the shoulder of the patient? Yes. Has everyone agreed which side of the patient we are proning? Yes. So the CBC is on the right, so we're going to slide to the right, to my right, right side up, and all the way over. Confirming roles. Who is the airway? Yes. Uh, who is in charge of the central line? I am. Who is coordinating the role? I am. Who is giving emergency drugs? I will be. Who is reattaching the monitoring? I will be. Who is reattaching the infusions? I will be. How do we contact help if required? We press the emergency button. Okay. So first of all we're going to put the slide sheets underneath, folded in half. So we're going to roll the patient to my left. Everyone happy? Ready, steady, roll. And back. And roll to the right to get the slide sheets all the way through. Ready, steady, roll. And back. We'll then place three pillows on top, one on the chest, one on the pelvis, and one on the legs, making sure that the abdomen is clear. We'll then place a sheet over the top. Take the two edges out, fold the top over, take the two edges out, and then roll together like the cornish pasty nice and tight. Okay. So we're going to do three movements, slide to my right, right side up, and all the way over. Is everyone happy? Yep. Happy with the line? Yes. Ready, steady, slide. Ready, steady, roll. Change position of our hands. Everyone happy? Ready, steady, roll. We'll take the top sheet off and check the position of the patient, readjusting the, the, the pillows as required. We'll then place the patient in the swimmer's position. So if they are facing to my left, we put the opposite hand up. The patient will remain in the swimmer's position for four hours. After four hours, the position of the hands and the face will be moved to the opposite side. So we put the arm down. We're then going to have two people lift up the shoulders and turn the head the other way. So ready, steady, lift. And back down. We'll then put the uh, opposite hand up into the swimmer's position. Okay. Uh, so for placing the 
patient back in the supine position, we will go through the checklist. Has the patient got all the lines required to uh, do the manoeuvre safely? Yes. Is the patient sedated and paralysed? Yes. Is the patient on 100% oxygen? Yes. Are the blue ET tapes in situ and safe? Yes. Is the NG aspirated? Yes. Are all non-essential infusions stopped and disconnected? Yes. Has the patient received any boluses they required? Yes. Um, have all non-essential monitoring been removed, including ECG dots? Yes. Is the catheter an FMS at the end of the bed? Yes. Is the patient's hand in the correct position? No, so we're going to put both arms down. And at this point, I'd also like to turn the head the other way, so that the CVC position, CVC goes over the top. So we'll lift the shoulders. Yep, yeah, pretty steady lift. And turn the head. Have we got essential monitoring in situ, ETC of two and saturations? Yes. What is the plan if the ET tube becomes dislodged? So we'll turn the patient to pine as quickly as possible and re injure it. Are emergency drugs prepared? Yes. Have we got a clean sheet and a new ECG dots? Yes. Have we got sufficient staff to complete the role safely? Yes. Are the tallest members of the team at the shoulders of the patient? Yes. Has everyone agreed on what side the patient will be rolled for unproning? So we're going to slide to my left, right side up, and then all the way up. Uh, who is the airway in this manoeuvre? I am. Who is coordinating the manoeuvre? I am. Who is in charge of the central line? I am. Who's going to be giving emergency drugs? I will be. Who will be reattaching the monitoring? I will be. Who will be reattaching the infusions? I will be. How do we connect? How do we contact help if needed? Press the emergency button. Okay. So we're just going to pull this sheet all the way through. And we'll place slide sheets underneath. So we're going to roll to my right. Ready, steady, roll. And back. And then roll my left to get the side sheets through. Ready, steady, roll. And back. So we'll place the top sheet over the top. So over the head and then turn it back. Put the edges of the sheet together and then roll it up like a coin capacity. Ready, steady, roll. So we're going to do this in three movements. We're going to slide to my left, right side up, and all the way in. Okay, everyone happy? Ready, steady, slide. Ready, steady, roll. Adjust our hand positions. And ready, steady, roll. We'll then take the top sheet off and check the position. Then it's going to come off. The patient is now unproved. 